Let's start. Iron the fabric from the wrong side using steam. This way we will achieve shrinkage of the fabric. Then we cut off the edge on both sides. Put the fabric on the table facing to you. Fold the fabric over the oblique face to face. Put the oblique edge of the fabric parallel to the table. First check the radius on the fabric. Mark with a marker on both sides. Next, from the upper corner, keeping to the marks below, draw your radius. I have it 23.5 cm or 9.25 inches. Next, from one quarter of the waist radius, we measure the length of the skirt plus 1 cm for the seam. Cut one part of the skirt. Repeat the same thing again. You can simply put the first part of the skirt on top. Draw around, fasten with pins and cut the second part. Put the fabric edge parallel to the table. Draw the length and width. Cut out. Repeat the same with spellum. Let's start with the belt. We put the main fabric with the wrong side to us. On top of the fabric we put the pallon glue side to the fabric. Next, put the cheesecloth folded in several layers. We iron the belt with steam. Fold the belt in half and iron it again. Next, we process the sides of the two parts of the skirt on the overlock serger. You can close the edges of the threads from the overlock. After we fold these parts face to face, fasten the parts with pins and stitch them on the sewing machine. Iron the sides of the skirt. Next, we put the skirt face to us. Fold it in half and make notches. In the middle of the front and rear sides. Do the same with the belt. Now we need to try on on the belt to the skirt to cut off the extra length. Temporarily, face to face, fasten the belt to the skirt with pins. Do not stretch the fabric of the skirt. Remove the belt, 
cut off the extra length, we join the belt face to face and sew its edges. At the same time, leaving not stitched about 3 cm or maximum 1.25 inches. Iron the seams, turning the belt on the front side, fold in half and iron it again. Next, connect the belt with a skirt with pins. We put the fabric of the skirt facing us and on top of it the belt. First connect with four notches. From the front in the middle of the skirt, sides, and back. Connect both parts with the rest of the pins. Before stitching both parts, put an elastic tape on top of the belt. This way you will know exactly how many millimeters or inches you have left for the seam. I have it 1 cm or 0.4 inches left. Sew a belt to the skirt. Next, we need to process on the overlock searcher. Belt along with the top edge of the skirt and below the skirt circumference. You can close the edges of the threads from the overlock searcher. Next, the upper seam we iron to the bottom. We fold the lower seam inside by 5-7 mm or maximum 0.28 inches and iron it. Pin the bottom seam of the skirt. We put the elastic tape inside the belt using a safety pin. Fold the elastic tape one layer to another, about maximum 2 cm or 0.79 inches. We sew it several times with a straight stitch and zigzag. We sew the bottom seam of the skirt. Iron it. 